Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you into the Dollar Tree for a shop with me and probably a little bit of a haul. Um, I do need to go in there and get some supplies for demoing my kitchen. We're going to be ripping out all the flooring and stuff in about a week and so I need to get a lot of supplies so I can cover up the rest of my house and whatnot but it's after 4th of July now so all of the new decor should be in for fall and whatnot. At least I'm hoping, crossing my fingers. Um, so I'm really excited to see what new stuff they have. Last shop with me they had so so many new items and you guys were just so excited about them. I know that I did get a couple comments saying my store doesn't have that and my store doesn't have this. Sometimes the stores, depending on the area that you live in, will be delayed in getting some of the products, but all the supplies that they get are sometimes different for the region that you're in. So sometimes you guys will find items that I don't get. So there's, um, I had the sunflower plates last time, but a lot of people said they were able to find the lemon plates, which are beautiful, but I haven't had those at my store yet. So they, each store carries sometimes a little bit different of a supply and know that if there's something that you see when you go shopping if you want it get it because likelihood of you going back a day or two later or even a week later they're not going to carry it that happens to me all the time I think oh I'll just wait and then they don't carry it later on a lot of especially items like the rustoleum that I found last time those don't come in and aren't going to stay in supply I'll be lucky if I even find it there today I'll look um, but because it's an oversupply from another store that they're most likely they're not going to carry it on a regular basis. So just keep that in mind when you go shopping. I'm very blessed to have a very clean store near me and this store has a really good stock of pretty much everything which is nice. I know some stores will carry more home decor or cleaning supplies or organization, um, DIY supplies. It just depends on the area you're in and each store will be different so that's why a lot of the girls will go to three or four different stores to get all their supplies. So with all that being said let's go ahead and go in and go shopping. I do need to get some supplies so if you guys enjoyed this shop with me be sure to give it a thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button notification bell that way you didn't miss out on any future videos. YouTube has been doing this weird thing lately they were there unsubscribing people and whatnot and it's so frustrating so make sure you are subscribed and you don't miss out on any future videos so with all let's just let me be quiet and let's go shopping <laughs> so right as I pulled up I noticed these are new I haven't seen these before they're really pretty blue um, and I don't know what the name is on them let's see so they're, they're called daisies and they have them in uh, blue they have them in yellow which are really gorgeous and they do have them in the purple is that the same flower maybe that's not the same flower but they do have a couple new flowers out which is nice but I don't see any fall yet oh they have those daisies as well too so they still have the sunflower plates and cups and bowls how pretty they are oh. so these are new they're like little jewelry boxes um, pretty cute and they have a couple different styles in them these my store now has flip-flops which is really nice I haven't seen these here before different styles to choose from school supplies are out now and how cute are these highlighting pens oh I like these I have a little different binder sets. Homeschooling or just have a smaller child, they do have various flashcards for them too. They have sheet protectors, 16 to a package, which is really good, 8 dividers. They also have 10 of these ones. That's really cute and that's lined, which is nice. It's an alarm going off outside. They have some really cute binders this year. Camo. Oh, that is so pretty. That's a good package right there. Let's see. It's so cute. Yeah, silver. A 
with the clear binders as well as the dry erase boards. And they have planners. Oh, let's look at this one really quick. See how this is laid out. Well, that's nice. They have divider pockets as well as just plain ruled paper as normal. Oh, now these are fun. Look at the um, pads for your pencil and pen. Those are so cute. They do have the weekly planner, which is a dry erase, and then they do have the monthly calendars that you can put in your binders. They have the composition books, and they have like this really pretty design with glitter on them. Really, really pretty. A couple different styles. They even have the mat with the butterflies. So pretty. Oh, and they have. They have all different new hangers here. Ooh, they haven't carried those before. They even have the drawstring backpacks. Little. Exciting. These are super cute. I have more planners down here. So let's see how this one compares to the other one. I like these a lot. These are really thin. But these are just mainly, I think, the monthly planner. Which is great if you have... have this style as well. Magic covers for your books. A whole bunch of different colors to choose from. Have dry erase locker paper now. Wallpaper. Hmm. That's pretty neat. The fall flowers out. Look how beautiful it is. Oh, so pretty. Ooh, these are pretty. They're a dark peony. That's a really pretty coloring. Ooh, they have these again. I used these last year. Oh, I cannot wait to do some fall DIYs and show you guys so many different ideas. These are like humongous cranberries, but that's not what they are. They have the fall picks. Ooh, these are really nice looking. They have these. These are a new flower. They have not carried these before. I haven't seen these before either. I've seen a couple girl, a couple of the girls haul these, and I these are so pretty. This is a new variety as well. So pretty. So many pretty florals to choose from. Over here in the gift wrapping area, they do have lots of different style boxes and they are so nice and they're really good size too. They even have some really big and deep ones. So pretty and then they have the regular round ones. Ooh, and then square. Baby items for a shower. Cute. 
cute little plates and this is new they've never carried ribbon for the babies at my store so really cute supply of that and they even have the thick wired ones as well never go wrong with the gift bags here they are huge for a dollar and so cute you can even frame these for the baby's room as well That's really pretty. <gasps> That's really pretty too. Oh my goodness. That is gorgeous. They do have ferns. A couple different types. I forget what this is called. My mom has one of these in her house. Um, but a few different types of ferns that you can choose from. As well as, what is this? No. Incense. That's new. The bins, the gray ones are gone. See how quickly those went in my store? They have a jar of seashells. These are cute. A couple different styles of them as well. Oh, those are new. This style versus this one. They had these last time. Follow your dreams. The only pumpkin I found so far. And they still have those keys, the key holders they had last time. It's a couple different in the wood was last time. Um, canvas prints here. Not canvas, but they're, yeah, the fabric canvas they're hanging. A couple different ones. Cute. They have this missing sock one, which is new. And then this is the one they had last time right here. And this one's new as well. Super cute. Go Dollar Tree. over here for your lockers and stuff you could put the wall decals on them as well as your binders too here's the solar stakes uh, the daily Shannon the daily DIYer did a DIY with those and did a really creative idea floor mats in. These are kind of, oh, never mind. There's that one. They have it in gray and then they also have, this is actually like a carpet style. The my store actually has a really good supply of pet stuff. So they have Fleet and Tick, odor neutralizer, they have shampoo, kind of different type of dog bowls. Really cute. They even have the harnesses and stuff. I showed these last time I was here, but they are the wood crafts, but they have this one which you can make a little piggy bank or a chest with, which is cute. And now they actually have an airplane as well. Uh, my son loves making these. And then they have the helicopter too and the race car. These are just laying here, but if you need extensions, they do have black and brown. I know they're just for dress up, but they could add some length to your hair as well. Last time they just had the canvas um, panels, just flat like this, and now they have the stretched canvas ones that are plain. They're not super thick, but they are great for just a dollar. Not bad. Great for, look at all the supplies they have for crafting for your kids, or even just for yourself. I mean, just tons of it. I picked up like three of the necessary things and then I picked up a whole lot more. So let me show you what I got. And I hope you guys don't mind if I do like the intro and the haul in my car. This isn't my typical day for filming. So if I go home, you'll have kids screaming and whatnot and playing. So hopefully you guys don't mind this. And I feel like it's just a little bit more personal this way too. It's just a little more casual and whatnot. So hopefully you guys like it. Um, I did get some of the school supplies. I totally forgot about back to school and they have a ton of good, good stuff. So I got some mechanical pencils. I did get this, um, life is, um, life is my favorite adventure and it's for, uh, flashcards basically, but it's on a ring already. I really liked that. 
some highlighters. I am going to be doing a back to school giveaway probably next month. Um, so be on the lookout for that. So I've picked up a few things for that. I did get the student planner, this one that I was showing you guys, as well as this one too. I really like these. I actually will pick up this one um, at the beginning of the year when they have it for me personally planning for my YouTube and stuff because it's just the month layout, which I really, really like. So I can lay out all of my videos and stuff and I like to plan them like usually like if I can a whole month in advance. I got this really pretty print. Um, it holds the stuff in your binder, but I love the floral print that's on it. It's really pretty. Um, I did pick up this binder, not binder, what is that called? The Just the notepad. I got this planner as well that goes in your binder. I got the binder dividers and the protective sheets as well. And then I couldn't resist. They had this really pretty pattern and it says love on it. The back is plain, but it's finished, which I really like. So it's going to hold up fairly well. I got some, um, what is it called? Tissue paper. I think that their tissue paper is the best buy because you get so many sheets for, um, well, this one's only eight sheets. Unfortunately, that's not the best buy. Their white one, I think has like 30 sheets or something in it for a dollar. It's such a good buy. Did you guys see all of those, um, bags that they had such a nice supply I was very happy about that i did pick up two of the drop cloths because i'm going to be taping off half of the house when i do the kitchen demo oh it's gonna be such a project oh my goodness i did pick up are these pens or pencils these are gel pens i liked the um pink and the purple color i got more mechanical pencils and then i did get the airplane for elijah he loves to do these craft ones and then let's see i got the glow sticks now somebody did say oh you don't actually get 20 glow sticks in here you do you actually get 20. they include the little bracelet piece um in there and then they also include the 20 glow sticks i counted i was like what i got gypped no it's actually a full 20. so thank you for the heads up but it is at least at my <clears throat> at least at my store they do give you a full 20 pieces of glow sticks itself I got some Mod Podge as well. And then for the florals, I could not help myself, you guys. There wasn't any pumpkins except for that one I showed you. Um, and I asked her, she goes, no, probably in about another week, week and a half, we're going to get the pumpkins in. Because I asked her, like, do you have any in the back? And she goes, no, we don't. So that's okay. Um, I did pick up these really pretty, like, burnt orange hydrangeas. I did a DIY with these last year loved them and so they didn't have any more last year so I picked up some more so I could make another uh, wreath out of them. I got these burnt orange sunflowers. They're very pretty looking. They don't look fake which is what I like. Um, I got the creamy hydrangeas. I got the cotton um, pick ones. I think these are really cool guys. I mean for fall you want to decorate on a budget. Dollar Tree Florals is the way to go. Uh, I got another one of the what is that? Let's just call it copper. And then I picked up these. These are not the ones that were outside that I showed you. These were inside. So pretty. They didn't have these last year. And I just like how dainty they are. And the coloring on them is like a, a really nice, it has a tint, hint of yellow in it, but it's a nice cream color. And I just think they're pretty. They're called mini mums. Well, that's why I was like, they kind of look like the bigger version or the smaller version of the bigger flowers. So these are the mums. I think they're really, really pretty though. Um, I think that's everything. So that is everything for this shop with me and haul. I really do enjoy taking you guys to the store and showing you all the supplies that they have. That way, if you guys are being creative and want to pick up something for just general life or DIYs, you guys can do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me. If you did, be sure to like it and also hit that subscribe button, like I said earlier. That way you don't miss out on any future videos. I have so many fun DIYs planned for the fall. I'm not going to start those, I don't think, till August. So be on the lookout for those. And I have so much kitchen renovation to do. Oh my goodness. So those are coming for you too. So I hope you guys have a beautiful, wonderful day. Thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.